Hello everyone, welcome back to We Know What You Like, Lucia here. Uh, today we are watching The Sandman Episode 3. This one's called Dream a Little Dream of Me. Singing the song, y'all. Um, yeah, so this is Episode 3. Um, if you're watching this episode right now on YouTube, there's two episodes ahead on Patreon. This show also has an uncut on the $1 tier. So if you want to sync up your own copy, you can. There's like a timer. There's a countdown. There's multiple ways for you to sync up your copy. So don't worry. Uh, last week, though, it was the Cain and Abel story of two brothers. The dreaming of what ifs on the younger brother's part. Because when you love someone, you let them kill you. Ha! That's what it said. That's what the show is selling you. But yeah, it's um, Lord, I was going to say death, Lord Dream um, spoke to the three fates, the three sisters, the three selves, uh, asked three questions, tried to ask more in order to find out where his weapons were, in order to be stronger, in order to make the, his realm correct again. But of course, we all know that that realm is shiz right now and that it's affecting things on the outside. We also had, I don't remember his name, but the, the guy that wears the glasses who has mouth for eyes. Um, he's like, I want to be out and about. I want to be chill. We also know that he can't directly kill Dream himself. So he was trying to get uh, the blonde lady to, who stole the necklace um, or the stuff um, to kill him. She's like, nah, bruh. And then he's like, where's Jonathan? And then he's in a mental hospital, and he's played by the actor who plays Professor Lupin, aka my char favorite character in all of Nar oh, excuse me, Naruto, what the fuck? In all of Harry Potter, so. Uh, yeah, I'm excited. I do enjoy the show. Um, yeah, let's get started right now. No. Oh. Astra, I came as soon as I got your text. What is it? What's happened? We have to go. We have to go out again now. We will tell is this a dream? What's happened. <laughs> he said it was an accident. Like when Mum died. Who? Is he? Where is he? Run now. Lord Joanna. What the fuck did you do? We was what? just having a bit of fun. Did you summon death or yeah, something? Fun. Summoning demons for fun. Who's we? Where are the others? We must still be inside. Inside the club. You don't want to go in there. No. No, I bloody don't. <laughs> Someone has to clean up your shit. Why clean at all? Probably for her. Yeah. Oh. Drag me to hell, why don't you? Premonition? All right, miss. We're here. Constantine. Who are you? Have we met? In your dreams. Your business, you and I. Get in line, bruv. Oh, I would love Wait, to just go there. Oh, let me see it. Thank God. <laughs> Take your top off. Because she doesn't like you, priests or whatever. Princess. Take this. I do. Ah, ordained. Wait, wait, are you absolutely sure you want to do this? It's a trap. <laughs> so he's... He's has it in her, not him. I don't think he's surviving, bro. Kevin's dead, sweetheart. Which makes sense. You know, a lot of times whenever demons come out, they leave the body fine. You're yeah, right about the demon, wrong about the host. Lord Morpheus. After all your time <laughs> You're away, real? Lord Morpheus. He is. Though I confess I almost didn't recognize you without your helm. <laughs> I where your helm could be. I presume it is in hell with the demon to whom it was traded. Yes. That voice you. truly. Like, Give me the princess and I'll tell you. Run along and fuck I know. To hell. I she ain't listening, bro. Um, this isn't going as smoothly no as you. I have no idea what you have done. 
I do that. And I've just tripled my fee. <laughs> I was trying to protect you. From whom? The sad man. <laughs> this naivety is gonna get you father. crushed. He's dead though. I told you, John, your father died when you were a baby. Yes. You've been saying that for years too. I mean, he did. Everything you lie for a living. You're Ethel Cripps, you're Ethel D, you're Madame Dode, and apparently <laughs> I'm a man called John Burgess. <laughs> Call her out. <laughs> Just for the drama. God, your father was a cunt who wanted me to afford you. True. True. That may be the first honest thing you ever said to me. <laughs> You want me to give you the ruby? Tell me more. Tell me everything. Exactly. And this time you tell me the truth. I mean, like, he is dead. Is he, he's, yeah, he's dead. I said the Sandman, and I meant to believe me Sandman. <laughs> yeah. Don't let him mess you about. <laughs> Haven't had a decent night's sleep in ages. Nor will you. Until we find the sand, we must go. Yeah, they're setting up a romance for us. This approach don't really work for you. You just turn up and all the people about. Yes. <laughs> Who are you? Exactly. Tell me your name. It's uh, Matthew, sir. <laughs> he thought it was what's her name. Matthew. I made it clear to Lucienne that I do not require a raven at this time. Yeah, she told me you'd say that. If I need assistance, uh, no, you I do will ask actually. She, she's getting I away, sir. She... That is the most normal voice into this entire show. Raven. Go back to the dreaming, Matthew. I don't like it. <laughs> CN is not your master. You told me you'd say that too. <laughs> do you know who I am? I still don't like the name entirely, but I. I don't even know who I am anymore. A couple hours ago, I apparently died in my sleep. Uh, and now I'm, I'm a bird. Oh. I have thumbs. I, now I have these things. That's cool. Yes. And you must use them to fly back to the dreaming. I forgot what the other bird's if name was. But what was her I story? Know that? I lived my whole life here. That's why Lucian sent me to help you. <laughs> my last raven came here to help me. Yeah? Where is he now? She died. Her name was Jessamy. That one. She died. Trying to help me. Why couldn't we hear her voice? She's gonna die. It's a nightmare. Yeah. Uh. At least there's not blood everywhere. Why do humans love objects so much? Memories, bro. Well, they do come in handy sometimes. You seem pretty attached to your sand. It's not just an object, it's a part of me. Well, if that's true, how'd you happen to lose it? I captured. It was stolen by another magic user called Burgess. Well, not Roderick Burgess. The old demon king himself, eh? Everyone used to say he was a fake. He said he had the devil locked up in his basement. How the fuck did you... Put two and two together. Thank you. What are you doing? Well, I should have done a little better. Protecting you? my son. If I give you this, you won't need the ruby. Interesting. He's like, good. I had all of these, um... Things planned, what I wanted to say. Go on then. So let me stop you. That's right. You look well. That's right. You look well. That's right. Oh, uh, right. Well, um, sorry to bother you. I left some things behind when we broke up, and I was wondering if. Did we break up? Exactly. You yeah. ghosted her. Uh, no, fair point. That was bad of me and wrong. Should have phoned or at least texted. Yeah, fuck it, fuck boy. And apologize properly. No, I get that you don't think you need a raven, but 
If you're out here waiting for human beings to help anyone but themselves, you're gonna be sitting out here in the rain forever. Whatever they're doing up there, they're why do you think about you. You're smashing. Uh, why do you think you were down there in the hole for so long? Because humans suck, bro. Like I said, smashing. I don't know those all told me to just get over you. Yes. You're selfish. Ruthless. Coward. That's right. Right, act. It was the sound. Oh. The sands of time waits for no man or woman. We can go. <laughs> leave her there. Well, we can't go. We can't leave her like this. Dream a little dream of me. Give her a wonder slumber. The sand was the only thing keeping her alive. If it wasn't for your sand, she wouldn't be like this. I'm not the one who left her with it. Exactly. What is wrong with you? Are you hold responsibility. What's the point of you? What's the point of you exactly? Where are you and you're going to acknowledge your own mistakes? Why is way if you want help? What the fuck is he supposed to do? Let, let her be in a, a dream state? Just forever? Happy moment. Again, someone who clearly. I don't know if he should have this you ability. Now you'll get someone who can help destroy the dream. So, what's our next move? I'm going in search of my helm. Hell. Let's go, Purdy. Hell. As in hell? Hell, hell. <laughs> gang, gang, let's go. Okay, that was the episode. Um. It's currently two in the morning, so I am not gonna make this a long outro because I need to go to sleep so that way I can go to work in the morning. Uh, but yeah, that was fun. That was good stuff. Um, I like this idea. This is not really idea. This because I've seen it in other stuff. I I like the 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 well, let's say idea actually, for lack of a better word, on my head at two in the morning of the way that con that cost time um dream M morpheus has is putting himself on the in the outskirts of humanity just doing what he does he says he just wants to uh put the state of the world right without actually breaching humanity's um emotions you know uh, I would like to know more info about Jessamine. I wonder, though, if... Because now we know that they're birds, the souls of someone who died in their sleep. I wonder if Dream knew her just before she was human. When she was human. That'd be fun to learn. Uh, I still think they're building to a potential romance between Constantine and Dream. Um, just the way their bodies are lined. Um, let's see what else. Maybe I'm wrong on that, though. Um, yeah, um, I do like the <laughs> the use Constantine saying using the guilt method of responsibility on him when I'm like Lady Mirror, look into it. Um, also, I forgot her name, but John's mom. Um, you know what kind of person your son is, and yet you've given him that amulet. Logic where? Um, my. Battery's almost dead, actually, so I'm not going to make this very long. Just know, two, if you're watching this on YouTube, two episodes ahead on Patreon. I'll see you later. Bye.